Welcome guys to the last tutorial of our contact app integration with Firebase and here everything is done our database our our storage our our everything is working perfectly so now what I want is like if I click on this then it should take me to my own profile activity so what I'll do is I'll I'll go to my main activity because that's where my image and toolbar everything is happening so image on toolbar set on click listener okay perfect and uh, here we will start activity new intent main activity this and we are going to profile activity which is the user who has locked it okay so that's that settles there and here what we have is we have our profile activity and we have it here we have some we have image view image I will not update but if you want just as we have updated the image uh, we you can do it by register act register account code or uh, the code that was used in add contact but I want to click on it and then we will see what happens so what is this here is update profile photo and update username and update user number okay so let's just call these views and uh, mm, yeah where is it profile activity okay let's just et username et number button update profile circular image view although we are not working with it but we have to set an image on it and uh, yeah pretty much it for now and we will take two strings username user number and let's initialize the views update number although we haven't worked on number but be patient update username update profile button and image view update profile photo I think yeah so first of all update profile button is going to trigger a method update profile And here, if username, if we are updating the username, then it should change it in database. And if we are, update profile is, uh, oh, sorry. If we are uh, updating the user number, then it should also store it in this variable and update it. And if it's empty, then it's empty. Leave it. But if you want, you can apply more condition, user number, username, create this method. So first of all, when I click on my profile, it should automatically show me what is the image, what is the username and what is the number. And then if I want to update it, then this button method should be triggered otherwise it should whenever this activity opens actually i'll run it right now so we'll see like we will see nothing actually so i want to be able to show you that what i'm trying to achieve here
if you want the source code you can go to github okay so once i click on this it takes me here but here i see nothing so when i want to come here i want to be able to see the image here that i am logged in here and my name and my number and then it's up to me if i want to update or not so just first of all before we update it we will work on displaying our information so database reference reference firebase database get instance get reference child let's take a firebase user also firebase user firebase auth get instance get current user what is the users because here I'll just close the storage because we are successfully done with it and we have fixed our problem also in the previous tutorials so okay yeah so in the users under my ID is is stored my image my email my and I will add one more I have added the child here but if I wanted I can just actually I should in register account I'll just pass so this is this I should have done but we can do it that way also and contact number the spelling are contact number okay perfect uh, okay we're going back to so users and whose information I want to display I want to display mine whoever is logged in so reference dot event listener add event listener and what will happen here I will call my user users model and users snapshot get value users dot class and in et number we want to display users oh sorry here I want to uh, just give me a minute guys yeah here I want to display this I in the users I have to add contact number contact number contact number And getter setter so coming back to this is our profile activity users et number set text this edit text should already be this once I am on this activity this edit text should be displaying my number and the image view glide with get application context load users whatever the user image was at the time of uploading should be set to our image view and our username added text should have users get username so what I'll do I'll just run the app before we work on updating that would be our last step 
So if it's successful, then it should show me the result. So we are logged in. Okay, it's showing me the image. It's showing me my name. It is showing me my number. And now what I want is if I want to change it, if I want to change it, or if I want to change the image, which I will not do because the code is similar. You can do it by yourself. But if I want to change it, then what do I have to do? Now I will come to this button and take the same reference. And reference dot sorry what we will do is hash map string object hash map new hash map hash map dot put which values do we want to update which keys so we have to write the name username And the key of user number contact number that was the key user number and the only difference is usually we add the value to the add the value to the database but since these keys are already there so we are just updating it so what we will do is reference dot update children and pass our hash map here and what this does is once we run the app and we click on our photo So it is giving me this now I will change it Samuels so it has changed my name here Samuels okay the number was also changed but I think something is wrong here yeah here in ET number I have to type number so yeah the 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 operation is successful but uh, the view casting was a little bit wrong so we'll just work with this once the app is installed okay app is installed and now what we will do is we will change our name back to yeah so here also name will update because it is fetching data from here that's the magic of firebase and yeah, here we'll change this to Samuel and I'll change my number 0063131 something 4242. Okay, update. So now my contact number is changed and my name is updated. Okay, so let's just this tutorial is done, but uh, let's just try to make it a little bit more prettier. Add on success listener on success listener when it's done update it finish this activity and also we will add some progress dialogue although I was planning on not doing it but let's just do it when once we are we are here already so PD new progress dialog this and PD set message updating PD show and after it is successful PD dismiss
yeah okay so i'll just go back and see if this is working you can apply the similar approach to sign in and registering user and adding contact you can add these loading messages looks really cool i will again change my number so now it is displaying the number that last was here change my name Okay, updating see you saw the beautiful progress dialog and I will if you want me to apply it to other so once it's logging in you can do it in login also progress dialog PD PD new progress dialog this and once it's yeah here pd set message logging in signing in pd show on success dismiss the pd and what else register account same thing progress dialog pd pd this PD set message registering PD show on success PD business PD business perfect and one last is uh, where adding account i think when we are adding the account here also we can take a pd 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 new progress dialog this and uh, yeah add contact is pd set message adding contact pd show on success pd dismiss pd dismiss pd dismiss so let's for the last time run our run up our application and just test it i will delete the contact so we can add a new contact okay so like we will have a refresh and maybe in firebase storage i should also delete everything so you know we just have like a new new from scratch in authentication also i will just get rid of this account storage I will log out from here first if you want to apply PD here also you can do that I'll just delete it delete these photos okay. 
then I will disable this user delete this account and also what I'll do is I'll delete this database and also the user information so you know we have everything from start okay so now there was nothing to be okay sign up loading a photo you can take a photo with camera also it will per it will work perfectly fine Steve Jobs jobs at apple.com one two three four five six registering and after registration is successful yeah it is taking some time okay register successfully registered we are logged in okay adding contact let's just use this test image name it room hotel one one two two three three hotel at gmail.com another progress dialog beautiful and contact added okay let's add one more you are seeing simultaneously how this is adding the information here gallery and now these images are not being overridden these images are adding being added one by one so it is also keeping the old image uh, okay let's name it Apple computer I wish I had more photos to show you here but let's just use these two and if I leave this empty type something honey because the toast message type add because it will not proceed if one of our field is empty okay adding contact okay contact is added and the image will be shown here lastly we go to our profile if I want to name it my contact another update it so guys this was a very successful tutorial this repository will be available on github uh, and look at the description also follow me on instagram and dm me there just say hi or you can tell me how can i make these videos more better and please subscribe to my channel see you in the next one